Hello, great that you could be with us. Today, Judy and I were talking about discipline. Oh no, no, don't go anywhere, the fun's just starting. No one gets anywhere in life without discipline and marriage is no exception. Just think of the old film and take it with a spoonful of sugar. But the one thing we haven't really got into yet that I think is really important is discipline. <laughs> now, we hate that word, uh, nothing but the discipline. <laughs> but uh, what role would you say that discipline has? It's like listening to a baby crying. Mm, okay. Uh, you don't always, it's not convenient that the baby no. cries right now, but the baby is crying right now. And you got to do something about so it. So you've got to discipline yourself to put aside what you wanted to do okay. in order to meet the need that of the other, the child that's crying. Okay, well, let's take a very real situation. Oh, here we go. What? The other night we were working on um, some filming. Yeah, this was after two days of work now. And I showed it to you, and you looked at it, and you go, oh, there was a, three or four big things where I just have to, like, throw out all kinds of stuff and refilm this and reinsert that, and oh. It didn't go well for you in the processing of it. Can you, can you tell me why? What? Okay, because I was kind of hacked off at having to do it over again. But I knew you were right. That's what, that hacked me off a little more. Because if you were wrong and I could argue the toss, I'd say, well, okay, well, I think you're off the rock, your rocker here. Then that would be easy, wouldn't it? But you weren't wrong. And that's why I go, oh, Chris, I've got to do it over again. Okay. Over, yeah. And there came a point in it where I said, stop, do something else. Mm. What was your reaction? I didn't do it and I got all hacked off. So where was discipline in there? It wasn't. Okay, now I think that's at the very heart of it. You said it beautifully, I think. You have to put aside what you want to do and do what you know is the right thing to do. And the two do not always get along. And Love that last line that Judy just said. Put aside what you want to do and do what you're supposed to do. I don't think I've ever heard a better definition of discipline than that. Now next week we'll be talking to David and Ella and how they'll cope with having children in their new marriage. God bless you and I'll see you then. Bye-bye.